Hey everybody, it's Jen, Scrapina Creations. I'm here with my vacation haul video. I just got back from San Diego, California visiting Danielle Brown and we had an amazing time. We were able to do some shopping while we were there. Literally, I got off the plane and we headed over to a local strap scrapbook store called Paper Tales and unfortunately I did not get anything from there. I was looking for some specific things but didn't end up getting it. But anyways, it's a very small haul. I did a pre-order with Joanne.com before I got there and sent it to Danny's house and it's mostly just supplies. So I was able to get my Spectrum Noir Ultra Smooth Premium White Card Stock 50 sheets. They were having a huge half off almost everything sale and so I just wanted to get some of my staple stuff that I use all the time that's hard for me to get here in Canada. So this is a 50 sheet pack and I think it was $8. Uh, the other thing that I ordered which are hard to get at a good price here and are kind of boring but are the Snap uh, Simple Stories pocket pages. So I do, if you're new to my channel, I do 6x8 pocket style scrapbooking. And this one here is my favorite. So it's the one with the two 3x4s at the top and the one 4x6 on the bottom. So I actually bought 10 packages of these because I think they were $2.99. Um, the other thing that I really, really wanted was the Tim Holtz Distress Watercolor Cardstock, which is four and a quarter by five and a half, and it's got a more deeper kind of texture to it on one side and then a really smooth on the other side and what I love about this is that it's really crisp white so I was really excited to get that and then boring right I got some Cutter B um, scissors which are really great for fussy cutting and I I'm really liking those um, so the other things that I got from there I got some paper pads 6x6 six six paper pads they were on for like $3 so I didn't have the Serendipity, the Dear Lizzie Serendipity yet, so I picked up that one. And then I also picked up Daydreamer, which I did not have in a 6x6. So that was awesome. And then I'm really late to the party on this one, the Bella Rouge by Pink Paisley, but it is absolutely stunning. It's just the pinks, the yellows, the blacks. It's just, it's so pretty. So that was my Joanne haul uh, order before I got to the States and sent it to Danny's. Then we went to Tuesday morning and I picked up another 6x6 paper pad. This is the Jen Hatfield Homemade and uh, it was $2.99. So love that one, I'm sure. I don't know how the lighting is. Um, you guys have seen this one too. It's really, really, really pretty. So picked up that. And then we went to Hobby Lobby while I was there, and I got um, a 3x4 and a 4x6 pad. This is Inked Rose. It's by We Are Memory Keepers, and it's so pretty. I haven't seen anyone show this yet, um, but it reminds me a lot of the one that they did um, that was like the Dear Lizzie, but I love it. It's got navies and mint and the bright pinks. So it's really, really, really pretty. I was really excited to see that. I love navy. I love it. It's one of my favorite colors. My When I was growing up in my teenage years, my room was navy blue. So this is the 4x6. So it's really pretty. Bloom where you are planted. Um, not crazy about the orange, but that's okay. So I got those, and then I got the fine line applicator, which is the standard tip. I also picked up, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, it's a Zig Millennium uh, 05 pen, and this one is acid free and archival quality, and um, it's really great. So I was using it on the trip for my journaling in the mini album that I was working on for the trip while I was there. And then I was so happy to find these thickers. Um, they're called 25 Days and they're in gold. And I'm going to be using these for my numbers for my December daily this year. So that's it guys. I really didn't buy a ton. Um, and Danny was saying it just, I don't know, the shopping, the crafty shopping just wasn't really happening for us while we were there. But I am really happy with what I got. So I hope you're all doing well. 
and I'm actually going to craft a little bit after I finish this video. So hopefully you'll see a video from me soon. Thanks everybody for watching. Have a great day. Bye!